Hi, my name's Mitz. Um, I'm just going to show you how to um, set up an account, um, an email account with Outlook Express. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll go down to the Start menu and we're going to press Email on the um, menu. Now, Outlook Express comes up and we're just going to go to the Tools menu and then we're going to press on Accounts. Okay. Now these are my different email addresses here. We're just going to choose a simple one for now. I'll just choose a Big Pond account. And if you go over to the side here, you can choose properties. So what you do is you make it, you just select it by press on it, press on it and make it blue. And then you go over to the side and you press properties. Okay, so we've got uh, the email address, reply address and all that stuff there. Now what we want to do is check out the servers. Now this is what you need to know. Um, you need to know the incoming mail server and the outgoing mail server. Now with Big Pond it's the same so it was pretty simple. All we had to do is type in those two things and you also need to know your account name and your password. Now other than that um, that's about it for that. Now if you wanted to add a new connection because I've already got an existing one you go to add up the top and then it says mail and it'll start the internet connection wizard okay and that'll take you through and ask you questions and it'll ask you what your mail server is what your username is what your password is everything it'll do it for you okay I'll get rid of that now um, I've also got a GoDaddy account here so I'll make it blue and we'll press properties. Now GoDaddy, um, I had to set up the um, internet mail a bit different okay, because they're not providing my internet service but they're providing my email. So um, I actually just got the instructions from them. Now they had two different incoming and outgoing servers so I've just typed exactly what they wanted there and also my account name and my password and also in the advanced section I had to change that to port 80 because every other one was port tw uh, 25 um, but all the instructions um, came with it um, usually anyone that's supplying an email will tell you how to set up your email account okay I'll get rid of that Alright, uh, that's about it. Okay, thanks for listening.